Well, it's uh, 5.30 in the morning. This is my female snow boa. And as you can see, she is in the process of delivering her litter. I just checked her about an hour ago and she wasn't doing anything and I fell asleep for a little bit and that's just my luck. Uh, a little bit about this animal. She's uh, born in 2008. This is her second litter. Uh, the male for this litter, I'll try and get a shot of in a minute. He's a bloody salmon and uh, last year he proved het for albino. So. We should have a really interesting litter here with hopefully some triple and quadruple hats for, uh, well, let's see, the genetic combinations are possibly endless here. Everything from bloody snows to bloody moon glows, uh, you name it, pewters, everything. All sorts of genetic combinations possible with this group. Um, Last year, she had a litter of 13 babies. Unfortunately, they were premature and only two survived. Uh, both are triple hats for blood, aniri, and uh, albino. And uh, both are females. They were born in January of last year, so they're a little over a year old. They're both doing well. I'll try and get you a shot of those in a minute here, too. As you can see, most of the babies are still in their sacks. Uh, I noticed one over here that's already kind of peeked his head out and begun moving around. And uh, I'm going to shut this off for a second while I see if I can relocate and get a picture of Dad who's in the condo next door. She's unfortunately kind of made a mess of the glass, so I'm going to see if I can slide it open a little bit without disturbing anything. Hopefully get everybody a better view. There we go. You can see we got another one being born right now. Looks like an albino, possibly a sun glow. Again, these will all be carriers for the the blood gene as well as the aniri gene. Really powerful genetic combinations here. Since I did hold back the two female triple heads from last year, I'm I'm hoping for a male sun glow out of this group to pair up with them. looking to be like quite a large litter as well I can't possibly do a count yet but definitely over 20 so far looks like she's got another one coming right now so I'll try and get you a shot of that Could barely see him there. Appears to be a hypo. Very nice.
Looks like we may have drawn the attention of mom too. I'll have to stay cautiously back here. Moms will defend their babies. There's a little one perking up right now. Looks like he just popped out of his sack. Getting his first few breaths. You know, as mom starts flicking her tail around, you see she's stirring some movement from the babies. Help get them going a little bit. Looks as though she may be trying to push out another yet. Yeah, quite possibly. Give it another few seconds here and see if anything else happens. She definitely appears to be pushing. I think we may have another one coming. See a nice little sunglow right there in front. Possibly several more still in their sacks. We'll know in a little while when they start coming around. It appears we got one more. Coming out now. There he is. Little hypo.
All right. Well, even if that's it and she could stop right now, I'd be really pleased. It's a beautiful litter. These babies, like I said, have some amazing genetic potential. Three recessive traits and, and one dominant trait. Their offspring have the potential to produce. Some animals we probably haven't seen yet. Well, I'm going to go ahead and shut this off for now. You know, it looks like she may have another one or two still to push, but once they're out of the sacks and moving them around, I'll get them cleaned up and uh, I'll make sure I get you guys some good shots of them. This here is the father of the litter. You can see he's a really nice looking deep red bloody salmon and uh, like I said last year he proved het for albino. I bought him as a possible het and that was really fortunate the way that worked out. And uh, when I reset this camera here in just a few seconds I'll try and get you some pictures of uh, the two surviving offspring the, the snow female had with him from uh, last year.